What's up guys? I'm making a new intro video because like at the end of the day stuff happened. It was crazy. So basically I went to two new spots today. I went to Coonskin Park and uh, went into the Elk River right behind like the golf course and ended up finding a lost item from there. I was able to contact the owner. We're making arrangements to meet up on Saturday and I'm going to get that back to him. So that is like the best thing like ever <laughs> that's easily the most exciting part of my day today but i also went to daniel boone park and um it's like a boat ramp and you know public access and people fish there and uh, i went off to the side and i found some interesting things there so like i don't know it's been a crazy day and uh yeah i don't know we'll just we'll just play the video and you can watch for yourselves what is up guys we are at a new spot today uh we're at a i think it's like a state park um there's a trail down that way it takes you right down to the river um you know i've been to the park before but i've never been down this trail but i know it's there and i've never been in the river here actually on the way here i've seen a spot a public access for the same river um so i might check that out maybe today or maybe another time but um you know it's a it's a nice park it's a beautiful day there is golf here there's a golf course so we might find some golf balls or something in there i don't know we might find nothing because um i don't know how many people actually go and get in the river right here but hey we'll figure it out and uh, i don't know let's get to it got out and walking back I'm a little out of breath um, didn't find a whole lot of stuff found some trash I found a couple of interesting items but uh, it's pretty clean right through there and it's also just really shallow but <laughs> there were a couple things that aren't on video that I found that that I really liked but I just found them wading through like the like four inch water like they were just there and I seen them and picked them up so um, Eh, we don't have that on video, but it's fun. I'm going to go back down to where I first came into the park, where it says uh, public stream access, and I'm going to go down there and see what that's about. I don't know if I'll get back in the water or not, but uh, I don't know. We'll go, we'll go see what it's about. What's up, guys? I got here to the public uh, stream access, and there's some people fishing down there and stuff, and I don't want to disturb them jumping in the water and, you know, just kind of aggravate them. So, uh I might go look for another spot, or I might just go home, so uh, if there's more after this, I went to a different spot. If not, I will catch you guys next time. Peace. Peace. 
What is up guys? I just came to another spot real quick. I've wanted to search this place for a while, but it's like a boat launch. So there's always people here. The parking lot's full and there's people fishing, but I stopped. There wasn't too many people today and I am super glad I came here. I found some interesting stuff today and it's probably the most fun I've had uh, while looking for treasure in the river. I mean, <laughs> found some cool stuff. So You'll see that here in just a second in the video. I did find a good bit of trash here too. A lot of plastic bags and stuff. So that was good that I got that out. But I gotta go home, get ready for a movie that's happening in about an hour. So I need to like shower and get changed and try to get back here to make it in time. But uh, I'm in a little in a rush. So I don't even have time to like edit the video or look at nothing, which sucks. But like 
had a lot of fun today, guys. Man, it was awesome. So uh, I will catch you guys in the next one. <laughs> okay, let's try this again. I kept messing up the video, mostly because I thought it was in video mode and it was in picture mode, and it just turned itself off. And I was like, why does it keep turning it off? Because I'm stupid and it wasn't on video. Anyway, we're going to go over the fines here. So we got what is, I guess, a license plate frame of some sort, maybe? It's what it kind of looks like. We found some cans. I found this PVC thing, part of a shoe. Um, I found, like, this cool, like, lid to, like, a ceramic bowl or dish of some kind. More pieces of glass. I found this, and when I first saw it for, like, two seconds, it was like this. So I thought it was, like, a teacup or something, but it's just a, the top of a glass jug, an old-fashioned glass jug, and then when I was walking in, like, foot-deep water, I found my golf ball, and I was like, yes, and then, like, as soon as I found that, I stumbled upon this also just wading in the water, it's a, it's a disc golf frisbee, and it's from this year, it's from, like, April, and I didn't notice at the time until I just picked this up. It actually has a phone number in here, guys, with initials or something. So we might be able to return this to somebody if they want it back. So we're going to give them a call here in a little bit and um, see if uh, see if they want us to like get this back to them. Um, so that might be kind of cool. First returned item. So we'll see what happens with that. That was the first place. Let's go to the second place. Second place, I found a whole bunch of this bag nasty stuff mcdonald's cup glass bottle it's not a good day in the river until you find a glass bottle we found mixed nuts uh i found part of a plate um, but then i didn't i don't have it here but then i found that um boat anchor which was pretty awesome i was already like yes i'm glad i came here for the just to find this boat anchor but then i found the rest of this. I threw it away there too because it's big and full of water and I didn't want any of that in my car. But <laughs> it was like a whole um, HP Pavilion like desktop computing tower. And like this is the hard drive from it, which is pretty awesome. Like that's the craziest thing I've ever found in the river. And uh, yeah, I don't know. I am like still pumped about it. Uh, <laughs> that was awesome. But now I'm pumped that I found, like, that phone number on the Frisbee. So I'm going to, like, clean this stuff up and, like, maybe try to give them a phone call here in a second and see, like, uh, if they want that disc back or just whatever. So, um, yeah. I don't know. Let's uh, see what happens with that. All right. So uh, I got the number pulled up on my phone. We're going to try to call this person and... Um, see if they want this back or something. Um, we might get a voicemail because they're like me. I don't answer weird numbers, but um, we're gonna give them a call. It kind of figured. We'll leave a message and see if we get something. Three, zero, four, five, zero, zero, four, nine, five. It's not available. Hi, uh, my name's Aaron, and uh, I go like out in the river and stuff, and try to find you know stuff people might have lost, and uh, make like YouTube videos and Instagram and stuff, but. I was out behind Coonskin today in the Elk River, and uh, I found this uh, disc golf frisbee, and it has some initials on it and this phone number, and I didn't know um, if it was important to you or anything, but if you would like, I would be glad to return this to you and uh, get it back to you if you want it. So uh, <laughs> I know that's kind of a weird phone call, but but I found uh, your uh, frisbee, so. If, you, if you'd like it back, just give me a call back and I can uh, mail it to you or something. Alright, thanks. <laughs> that was bad. I sounded so nervous. Ah! 
So uh, we'll see if we get a phone call back from that. And if they want their uh, frizzy back, I'll give it to them. Till then, I'm going to put it in my drawer and uh, keep it safe. So, all right, guys. Like, what a crazy day, man. Like, we found computers. We found anchors. We found items potentially to be returned. Um, if I do end up talking to the guy at the end of this, you will see another clip, and I will talk to you about it. I was supposed to meet up with Chris to return his frisbee today, but his schedule isn't really working out, and, you know, next week, I'm with my job, my schedule's probably not going to work out, so I'm going to mail it to him. We're still going to get this back to him. Uh, first thing Monday, I'll go to the post office, and I will get this out to him. He gave me his address, so still get to return it, and that feels really good. Um, yeah, so first return item, guys. It's pretty awesome. So, um, Chris, if you ever watch this, uh, if you lose your frisbee again, just give me a shout, bro, and I will, uh, hop in the river and go look for it again. <laughs> Alright, guys, well, that's it for the video, finally. It was kind of a hot mess, the, uh, but, yeah. <laughs> I'll, I'll see you guys in the next one.